Hello and welcome back to our first carnival cruise. Today is our first port stop and we're going to Half Moon K. So started this morning with my usual little coffee run to the coffee shop and then we headed to the buffet to get some breakfast. Joshua loved getting his full English in. The food was really, really good here. We enjoyed everything. I know this particular section that we're at looks a little empty, but the staff were constantly topping up the food. There was plenty of everything and multiple stations offering the same things. So there was always somewhere you could go to grab your food without particularly having to get in a queue. We never found it to be overly busy. And there was also a really, really good selection. Like Harrison loves cereal. So he had cereal with ice cold milk cart and every morning, which he really enjoyed. And like I say, Joshy just loved his little English breakfast in the morning. Come on then, beans. Yeah. And bacon. At the end, that lady's got some nice crispy bacon. You want some of that, do you? Yeah. There are some drinks that are included in the all-inclusive package, including fruit juice with breakfast and tea and coffee. There's also milk and chocolate milk cartons. So as lots of people have disembarked already, the decks are pretty quiet. So it's a nice time to just come and show you around everywhere without lots of people being in the way of my filming. <laughs> As you can see, there are plenty of sun lounges. However, these do go very quickly on sea days. So you do need to come down and find your spot pretty early. And there is a view we have this morning of the beautiful Half Moon K. It's absolutely stunning here. The video doesn't do it justice. I can't tell you how gorgeous it is. So this track, the blue track, is actually the exercise track that goes all the way around this deck. Here you have mini golf. So there's plenty to do with the children. This is the high ropes course that Joshua done the other day. You do have to make sure you're totally dry. So do that first thing in the morning or after you have spent some time drying on your lounger. They will not let you on if your clothes are in any way damp. There were several fuseball tables and pool tables around the deck. The boys loved playing on these. And then you've got your slides at the back there. This is the shuttle boats coming over. Once these started, they were coming back and forth. There were several of them and it was quite a quick process. Spare fishing. Good morning. I can hardly see anything. Can hardly see anything here. The sun is so strong. We are just up on the top deck and the shuttle boats are now coming over, ready for our first island stop. We're going to Half Moon Cape. Boys took advantage of the basketball court being emptied and had a little play in there. Obviously, this is very popular with the teenagers and younger people on sea days. There we go, pool table, like I said. And here's a great view of the pool at the back of the ship where you've got the two hot tubs either side. This is a quieter area, really nice pool area. Here you have the little mini clubhouse. This is air conditioned, a lovely cool place to hang out. We just had to wait for the number on our card to be called and then we headed down to I think it was deck one where we were queued and waited in line to get I on the to shuttle okay, boat okay, to go okay. across to Half Moon Cay. pleasant ride across to the island and when you arrive in port you come to this little area there's shops bars restaurants we didn't actually spend any time looking around here we knew that we wanted to come and just hang out and chill on the beach for a few hours with the boys so we walked down to the beach area the beach is breathtaking it is absolutely stunning here 
clear blue sea powder white sand it is gorgeous beautiful half moon k when we got off off the ship onto our little boat that brought us around it was about a 10 minute ride we did have to wait on the boat for a little while for everyone to load it up which was really hot but it's a lovely little trip over the beach is absolutely beautiful now down that end is where you get off the ship and we have walked right to the end so gone past all of the busy section of the beach and we've pretty much got this lovely section to ourselves it is beautiful the sand is like powder the water is crystal clear Boys have got their snorkels in, having a little snorkel around and looking for some fish, but it's absolutely gorgeous. If you want to get the sun loungers, umbrellas down that end, you need to get off the ship early. They look like they're all gone now, but we are quite happy here. We've got some bushes behind us if we need some shade, and it's just a stunning place to spend our day. to ship for a late lunch and headed to Guy's Burger Joint. Now, I thought the burgers here, we all thought the burgers and chips here were awesome, really, really tasty, lovely. Could eat these literally every day. Joshua didn't want a burger. He headed into the buffet and came out with these barbecue ribs, which as you can see, were very tasty. Harrison loved them too. So we ended up going and grabbing a big plate of those to share between us as well. I can't even remember what we had for dinner this evening. I think we just popped to the buffet and then we headed to the show at Liquid Lounge. Tonight was Flick. It was a little bit different, but still fun and the children enjoyed it very much. Then we headed to, I think it's Ocean Plaza on deck five. I found my new favourite drink, which was the Berry Sangria. It was amazing. And we sat and listened to Jaden and Beth, we loved both of these. Really good singers. They put on a really good show. They sang together and individually on various nights. Picked up milkshakes for the boys, which they also loved, and just generally chilled for the rest of the night, listening to music before heading off to bed after another fabulous day. So I hope you've enjoyed this day of our cruise. 
please join us in the next vlog when we will be heading to Grand Turk for the day.